Grumpy Guy Gaming is a jackass. Stay away from his channel. What is up, beautiful people? It's Wolf Brother Mythos Kushinata from the channel Frost and Fist, and welcome to this video. And actually, Grumpy is a really awesome and generous guy. If you haven't checked out Grumpy Guy Gaming yet, go over and check out his channel. And this video is an unboxing because that is how generous and awesome Grumpy Guy Gaming is. And a little inside joke, I asked if there's any way that I could assist with the shipping cost, and he said it was a gift, so I don't need to pay for shipping, but what I should do is tell him that Grumpy Guy Gaming is a jack and people should avoid his channel, so. Um, paying the piper, but actually, it's not true at all. Grumpy Guy is a hugely generous and just really awesome guy. He's got some good tutorials, uh, one thing I want to tell you about is recently I was trying to figure out how to do the red triangles that are so prominent in white scars and he was like, you know what, I got you this weekend, tutorial just for you. So I mean that's the kind of level of generosity he has. Something else that's very prevalent on his channel is he does a lot of unboxings of very cool, very different models, not the same kind of models that you're going to see you know everyone else unbox he has a large variety and he does some phenomenal paint jobs on it. but watching one of those great unboxings your wolf brother being a fan of game of thrones and of course as a wolf brother loving to represent house stark one of my favorites was a series of house stark soldiers and other characters for house stark well i commented on how amazing those were and how i'd love to get my hands on one someday and he said, you know what? I've got an extra House Stark soldier. I'm gonna ship your way. And so that's how we ended up with not paying for shipping costs and making sure to tell everybody that he is a quote unquote jack -ass. But no, he's a really, really awesome guy. How generous do you know of someone who says, oh, you like this? I got one, it's on its way. So that is just really awesome of Grumpy. So here it is, and he says he threw in a little something extra. So. We're going to take a look at what amazing generosity Grumpy has sent my way. Um, if uh, terrible knife skills uh, make you nervous, or not terrible knife skills, I'm actually pretty good with knives in just uh, not the most careful way. But I mean, I think being able to throw them and hit bullseyes is a kind of knife skill, right? So here we go. What is in the mystery box? So, opening it up, we got some, look at this. He took some care packaging this stuff. He didn't want it to get messed up in the mail, no crushed packages. So really, really nice and sturdily packed. Okay, revealing inside the awesome goodness. The first thing that we pull is Check that out. A classic Ragnar Blackmane. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Grumpy. And I love that uh, this classic Ragnar figure is uh, painted up with the blonde hair, kind of uh, reminding me of the artworks of uh, Russ himself. Thank you so much, Grumpy. That is awesome. And you know what? Uh, as a huge Space Wolves fan, it is kind of a shame I don't have a Ragnar in my collection. Check out the House Stark Soldier. I'll put up a picture of a little closer up view. That is awesome. And definitely, I, I really love the look and the aesthetic of House Stark. and. Uh, I always thought to myself that, you know what, maybe those could be like, you know, my, my noble Fenrisian tribesmen. There is even more in here. Oh my goodness. Classic, 
classic and actually amazingly painted. I bet this is one of Grumpy's pieces. Look at that. That right there is classic pewter Logan Grimnar with so much detail. I mean, there are Fenrisian runes all through the cloak here. Extremely well painted. Love the facial detail. That is an awesome piece of art. And, you know, the, the pewter models, especially as we go into this computer generated plastic series, they look amazing, great detail, but that really makes gems like this a real piece of history. So that is amazing. Thank you so much, Grumpy, my man. And then, oh, there's even one more gem. Oh, wow. So you guys may know that I've started a somewhat new Ultramarines army. And check that out. Classic Ultramarine here. That's really awesome. Very cool. So I've got some some real pieces of history here. Also, as happens sometimes with pewter models, there is the High King's axe, the head to his axe. It's not snapped off. You can see the little ball joint there. So that's just going to be a real quick, easy job to super glue that back onto uh, Logan Grimnar's uh, axe there, but that is amazing. So I got the House Stark um, foot soldier, but then I got some real, real uh, historical pieces for Warhammer, including a classic Ultramarine, Logan Grimnar, and of course, an amazingly, amazingly painted um, High King of Fenris himself. So that's amazing. Thank you so much, Grumpy. So <laughs> please, please nobody take to heart at the beginning of the video when I said that Grumpy was uh, a jack wagon because, you know, that was just a little inside joke between us. But he's an amazing guy. Go check out that tutorial that uh, he posted for my question about white scars markings. Go check out some of his really awesome uh, unboxings because, like I said, there are a lot of cool miniatures, things from 40K, things from Age of Sigmar, things from Star Wars, things from uh, cool mini or not, that you're just really going to find a variety of amazing figures unboxed on his channel. Thank you so much, Grumpy, my brother. And if any of you like seeing me unbox this amazing gift from Grumpy, then grab up an axe and smash that like button in the name of the Emperor. Drop me some comments down below. Let me know about what you think of these gems from a time past. And of course, the new House Dark uh, Foot Soldier, which is pretty awesome. And uh, if you guys are not yet subscribed to this channel, then Freak and I would love to have you as part of the pack here on the Frost and Fist. Feel free to check out our Patreon and see if any of those things that we have to offer there would interest you whatsoever. And of course, if you haven't checked out Grumpy Guy Gaming's channel yet, go subscribe right now because the content is just awesome and he's a great guy. Until next time, guys, stay frosty. Man, that's cool. Oh, I'm still recording. Jeez.